by my buddy actually and the marinated beef is number 71 so I'll leave a screenshot of the menu as well just in case if you guys are in the area definitely check it out the chicken wings come with this sauce but actually I'll be straight up with you it smells horrible so I'm not gonna dump anything in it. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna try the wings. So 
Biting into the chicken wings is pretty solid. Um, the garlic and the green onions, very good flavor. Fairly standard chicken wings though. Uh, the butter beef, it seems like that special sauce that they have. I think they overdo it, honestly. Um, it's very fresh in the sense like the cilantro is in there, very decent. Um, yeah. Definitely recommend that you get like a side of rice just because uh, the items that I ordered was like a little like protein. So. I might ask for a side of uh, sriracha just to put on this. You guys have hot sauce? Yeah. Having that butter beef dish it comes on a pool of their house sauce, I would immediately drain the hell out of that dish just because there's so much of that sauce. But it's good, but they have a hell of a lot of sauce on it. It tastes super fresh, cilantro, and garlic. It reminds me of something that I've eaten at home before, which is pretty chill. Uh, yeah, the wings are all right. I mean, like the skin on them. I'm pretty sure I can fry better wings myself, honestly. Uh, but the fact that they have like green onions and garlic and yeah, they're decent.
Kind of trippy. When homies ask me, uh, do I go to like Vietnamese restaurants to like get food and stuff like that? I usually say no, just because I can probably make it better than the restaurant I'm going to. Uh, but the food that I ate today, I would recommend that people try, just because when people say like, "Yo, do you know like Vietnamese food other than like pho and stuff like that?" and I kind of get like a little baffled, just because. There's a lot of people from that country, but not many people really know about like, the kinds of foods that they offer. Uh, typically, they think of like Mexican food, like burritos, tacos, chalupas, all that stuff, and like Chinese food, Japanese food, Korean food, and all that. But if you're in the Vancouver area, they do like a double whammy. They have Cambodian food too. I uh, can't really vouch for the Cambodian food, but this, these dishes that I've had, they're pretty decent. Uh, in terms of rating for the wings, uh, I've had something similar like at my house, but these are pretty good as well. I'll give it an 8, and for the butter beef, the texture's nice. It's getting a lot of flavor from the house sauce and the cilantro. Um, it's very unique. It tastes something like it's homemade, so I like both dishes. Highly recommend if you're just uh, to come with friends, uh, but if you just go by yourself, get these two dishes, side of rice, good to go. And uh, yeah, so wings eight, butter beef, I'll give it an eight and a half. Two highly recommended dish dishes, and if you're in the area, it's in a sketchy area. Uh, Definitely try to take like public transit. Uh, you might risk it if you park on the street because there are a lot of homeless people on the outside. But other than that, good Cambodian, good Vietnamese food at Phnom Penh. And until next food review, guys, thanks for watching. Peace.